Good morning and welcome to 4x4 Knuckle Busters. I am your host, Brett. And on this video, we are going to go over some very, very exciting stuff. Stay tuned and find out what's in store. Hi. One mile in fog patches and showers early Friday, but improving to greater than six miles on Friday morning. Stars shining bright above me. Night breezes seem to whisper. Second more tree. Dream of the Yes, just like the title suggests, we are already selling one of the 4x4s. Is it going to be my mom's 2018 Ram Eco Diesel Laramie 4x4? Is it going to be Shihara 2013 Jeep Wrangler JK in Freedom Blue? Is it gonna be the infamous and most famous on the channel right now, Black Ruby 2013 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon JK Unlimited? Is it gonna be the 1995 Jeep Wrangler YJ with 63,000 original miles on it that we just got? Or is it gonna be the 2019 Dodge Dakota SLT 4x4. Well, yes, it's going to be one of them. But I'm not going to tell you which one it is. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm totally going to tell you what it is. That's what this whole video is actually about. It'd be kind of pointless to make a video about selling a vehicle without talking about which vehicle it is. So, some of you watching the video might automatically go to Black Ruby because there's no more 4x4 Knuckle Buster stickers on it. Well, you may be right, or maybe I took the stickers off because in a previous video I talked about getting it painted or doing other modifications to it. It may be because of that reason, or it may be because we're selling it. It may be the Jeep Wrangler YJ that we just got that has 63,000 original miles on it. Maybe, but would we get rid of something we just got as a project vehicle? Knowing me, possibly. It may be the Dodge Dakota 4x4 SLT. Or, it may be the 2013 she I can tell you one thing, it's not gonna be. It's definitely not gonna be my mom's truck. This, this is her actual dream truck and she's worked very hard to get it. She, this is not going anywhere, probably ever, ever. She loves this truck and I love that she loves this truck and I helped her get her dream truck. So we can X this off the list of going. This is not going anywhere. So that leads us to Black Ruby, the 95YJ, and the Dakota. Well, I don't know how to say this. It really pains me 
to say this to all you guys that want this truck, but no, this truck's not for sale either. So now that leaves us down to the three Jeep Wranglers. Which one is it gonna be? Well, you all know how much I love Black Ruby. Could it possibly be Black Ruby? My wife, as much as she complains about it, not gonna guess all that stuff, she loves this little Jeep. She got her driver's license here in it. She loves the Jeep. And of course you have to, I love YJs. You know I've had one on the channel, two technically of my nieces, but I've had a lot of YJs in my life, just not on YouTube. So, which one is it gonna be? Well, I hate to say it, but it's not the wife's Jeep either. Although I love Jeeps, it's not my favorite Jeep of the group. It serves no other function that that one doesn't, or that one. It's just another two door, like that one, just newer. So, it's not the mom's truck. It's not the wife's Jeep. It's not the Dakota. It leaves us down to two. Interesting, interesting. Would I really get rid of the Jeep I just got? So soon already, haven't even done anything to it other than throw half doors on it? Or my all time favorite, yes, even more than MJ, and you guys know I loved MJ. I even said it in a video. My all-time favorite Jeep. Which one? Well, it really, really, when I had to make a decision, really struck me in the heart. But one of these does have to go. One of these are gonna be going and is currently up for sale. And it is Black Ruby. Yes, yes. I know I've said that I'm not gonna sell Black Ruby anytime soon, but it seems like every time, time I say that, not too long after I have to get rid of the vehicle. I gotta stop saying that. Yes, we are selling Black Ruby. It is up for sale. It will be going as soon as somebody's interested in buying it. But new projects, life changes and it was a hard decision but ultimately it was the smart decision so yes dakota stain yj stain she hair stain and my mom's truck stain now that being said i am going to be heartbroken but i do want somebody to get it that's going to go to a good home and is going to treat it as well as i did more on the YJ to come. If you like the content and you can't wait to see more content or what's going to be happening with the vehicles we have, including the new one, stay tuned for the next video because I am going to go over, sorry for the helicopter. Yeah, so sorry about that. There was a helicopter going over and neighbors came over and said hi. So, in the next video, we will be going over the new project. What's going to be, it's just going to be an information video. And then the following video after that will be starting to work on it. But in the next video, we are going to be going over what we're going to do with the 95YJ. Also, I am going to need your help to decide on a name and theme and color. We will be going over that in the next video. I got a couple ideas of where I'm gonna go with it, but I'm gonna be turning to you guys to make a final decision. So, if you like the content, please hit that subscribe button, that bell notification, so you can tell when the next videos are coming up. And also hit the likes, that actually helps out the channel a lot. Until the next video, 
I am Brett, and welcome to 4x4 Knuckle Busters.